The schnoodel dog is also known as a schnauzer poodle mix. Whether you choose a mini schnoodle or a giant schnoodle, you'll get a dog that's intelligent, loyal, and friendly. Both parent breeds come in three size varieties, so the exact size of your schnoodle will vary depending on what parents they have. Schnoodles come from two very distinguished and popular breeds, so, let's take a closer look. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him, her. Link to the free, secret training technique, guide is in the description below. Exclamation mark. The schnoodle dog is a mix between a purebred poodle and a purebred schnauzer. As the mix is still climbing in popularity, not many specifics are known about the original time and purpose when the schnoodle first came on the scene. But, the cross was likely first developed in the 1980s in the United States. Like most poodle mixes, the goal was most likely to achieve the perfect dog for people who suffer from allergies to dog dander. As well as those who prefer not to have dog hair coating their clothing and home. The poodle is often considered a hypoallergenic breed. Schnoodle dog appearance. The basic appearance of this mixed breed can be hard to pinpoint. This is because there is so much potential for variety. This hybrid comes in many sizes, as it is achieved by breeding a toy, miniature, or standard poodle with a miniature, standard, or giant schnauzer. Poodle. Toy. 10 inches and under, 4 to 6 pounds, miniature, 10 to 15 inches, 10 to 15 pounds and standard, 15 plus inches, 50 to 60 pounds. Schnauzer. Miniature, 12 to 14 inches, 11 to 20 pounds, standard, 17.5 to 19.5 inches, 35 to 50 pounds and giant, 23.5 to 27.5 inches, 55 to 85 pounds. Unless otherwise specified, a schnoodle will usually combine a standard poodle and a standard schnauzer. Schnoodle coat. Unlike other doodles, schnoodles aren't sought after for a fleece or poodle-like coat. In fact, the teddy bear schnoodle dog, or one with a soft and fluffy but not necessarily curled coat, an equal mix of the schnauzer and poodle's coats, is highly sought after. When you cross a purebred poodle with a purebred dog which does not have a curled coat, such as the schnauzer, the offspring may or may not have a curly coat. Appearance traits like this are unpredictable, and even puppies in the same litter can have very different coat types. Schnauzer Poodle Mix Temperament for the schnoodle cross, an F1 puppy's temperament may either reflect the schnauzer's or the poodle's temperament. With a first-generation cross like this, it's hard to predict exactly how the puppies will turn out. Selecting a later generation of schnoodle cross may help you get a puppy with breed-specific looks and tendencies. But, you cannot predict every trait with 100% accuracy. Training and exercising your schnoodle. Your hybrid will be intelligent and probably very active. With good socialization and training, he will also likely be friendly with all sorts of people and get along well with children and other animals. Stick to positive reinforcement methods to create a strong bond between you and your dog. This will also help you to avoid any potential stubbornness. Like schnauzers, all classes of poodles are very active dogs who love stimulating activities that keep their bodies and brains moving. They do not take kindly to being bored. Poodles also do not like being left out of activities with you or being crated for long periods. They are intelligent, working dogs who want to have something to do or play with, which is why many of them are amazing in the show pen. Training can be a great way to offer your schnoodle mix some mental and physical stimulation each day. But, this mix will also need structured exercise. Schnoodle health and care. Like any dog, the Schnauzer Poodle Mix may be predisposed to health conditions due to their genetic makeup and or age. Schnoodle health risks to be aware of, heart diseases, brain, epilepsy, eyes, progressive retinal atrophy and cataracts, joints, hip and elbow dysplasia, patellar luxation and liver disorders. Coat care. A Schnoodle may inherit its Schnauzer parents' wiry, hard, and medium-length double coat, or its poodle parent's long and thick curly or wavy coat. Or it may have a wavy coat that falls somewhere in between. Regardless of a schnoodle's breeding, 
His coat will require some maintenance. Hybrids with a Schnauzer's coat will require a weekly brushing to keep the coat smooth and if your mix has a Poodle's curls, which are kept longer, she will require daily combing, as well as a trip to the groomer once per month to prevent matting. Schnoodles with the Teddy Bear coat may need more or less of the grooming that we described above. What is the Schnoodle life expectancy? Poodles and Schnauzers have a generally similar life expectancy with about 10 to 12 years for the larger sizes and closer to 14 for smaller. You can expect your mix to reach somewhere within the averages of the parent breeds, depending on size. As long as they receive good veterinary care and general care throughout their lives, schnoodles will often live well into their teens. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the secret training technique guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.